Good morning, Port St. Lucie. Welcome back to another episode of PSL Daily Download, your first stop to all things real estate in Port St. Lucie. Today, we're going to make it quick. We're going to go over the numbers, touch on rates, which they have been moving, and I'll let you know how. Uh, and then we'll end it with the uh, market, kind of see where we're at as far as uh, uh, the market goes. So let's start with inventory. Uh, again, beginning of the month, not a lot of movement, obviously, number-wise, but percentage-wise, uh, again, I'm not going to go over all of the numbers here, but you can see them right across the bottom. What is still continuing the trend uh, from last month is properties that have been reduced in price continue to come off the market. So that inventory has come down from 632 to 612, which is a decrease of 3%. Again, continuing that trend. And then properties that are listed for rent have increased very minimal at this point, but 0.22%. So not a lot of movement there. Let's go to um, Mortgage News Daily's daily rate survey. They have, again, for the end closing of the last business day, which was yesterday, they ended the day at 7.11% interest rate on the 30-year fix, which is down 0.06%. They also have the 30-year fix rate ending yesterday at 6.62%, down 0.13%. One three percent, which is great, great news because I also uh, have been getting updates this morning, and it looks like the rates are uh, the pricing is lower on the rates uh, by about six basis points. So every little bit counts. Uh, we could see where we were at seven point two five two seven uh, just a few days ago, and we are now uh, in the lower seven percent range. So. Again, very uh, positive movements uh, for buyers and sellers because um, it gives them the opportunity to find sellers that, uh, buyers that can qualify easier. So, all right. And let's go to CNBC's uh, U.S. Market Watch. Lots of red. Lots of red. So uh, even this VIX is red, believe it or not. So the VIX tracks the volatility in the market. So... Although it's green, that means volatility is up, which is obviously a negative thing here. Now, U.S. 10-year 10, 10 Treasury yield, which is uh, what mortgages usually follow. Again, not specific, not uh, not specifically, but generally speaking, they that's what the mortgage rates follow. They were at four, or they're at 4.355 percent, down 0.47 uh, points, or 1.068 percent. So, although this one's red. It's actually a positive thing for uh, buyers. So that's really good for the mortgage industry. So other than that, I really don't have much to uh, go over here. Uh, it's later in the day. I got a busy day. I'm sure you do as well. So I'll let you guys go. Have a fantastic Tuesday and I will see you guys tomorrow.